Thank you for joining us at the USU Career Studio. I'm your host, Atlas, and this is Career Tip Tuesday. It's important to know what to expect once a job offer is made because this is a skill that doesn't come naturally. You don't always have to take the first offer, so let's explore what options there are so you can pick what's best for your own situation. Understanding the average salary of the job and knowing your worth is important during negotiations, but considering other factors could be important too. Evaluating the job's content and the culture of the company is vital. This is because most jobs take up the majority of people's days, so the environment and benefits of a job could severely impact your productivity and success. On top of that, you might want to consider the amount of hours the job will take and your commitment to it depending on your personal circumstances. Once you have a well-rounded idea of how the job could impact you and your future, take some time to prepare for the negotiation. Make sure you know your worth and try to keep a positive mindset throughout the process. You could do this by identifying your leverage and preparing a plan for the negotiation. Research average salaries and ask friends in your field about their job. Consider your related experiences and talk about the salary you deserve based on your own research. You could also always use other offers to make a stronger negotiation. Try to remember to be flexible and think about the future as you negotiate. There's no need to be in a hurry to commit, so don't feel under pressure to accept the first number. I'm one of your hosts, Atlas, and thank you for listening to this week's Tip Tuesday. If you enjoyed today's episode, then you might have fun taking our free Canvas course. Click the link in bio for more information, and we hope you can join us next Tuesday for a new career tip.